Man, what a beautiful day. I have Rebecca Wynn here. She's from Tosh. And uh, we're talking about running, and we're going to debunk some myths, right? Yes, we are. We okay. have an upcoming clinic, mm -hmm. and we're going to talk about common myths and things that people hear about and just clear up some of the confusion. Okay, so, well, let's go over some of the myths then. Okay. Um, you need to stretch well before and after. Yeah, so there's a lot out there. Is should we stretch before and after? What kind of stretching do we do? And we're going to clear that up and make sure you know it's really important to get the stretching in after. Okay, so. after is more important. Yes. All right. Uh, an injection for an injury will be a quick fix. Yes. Yeah. We're very <laughs> impatient as runners. And yes, so we, we want are. the quick fix. And so the idea behind this is just to let people know some of the pros and cons and make a better educated decision before they just go in and say, I want to run this race. I'm going to get that injection and be on right. my way. Um, all I need to do is get in an X amount of miles to get ready for the race. There's more than just putting <laughs> in some miles in the distance run. So we're going to talk about the importance of some of the other training that you can do. Okay. Strength training makes you too big and you can't <laughs> run as well. See, right. I do strength training. I'm too big. Not really. Um, so yeah, that goes along with just putting in the miles and knowing that there's more that you need to do rather than just run. You've, sometimes you got to get off your feet and do a little bit more to help build some strength and make you more efficient. Okay, running is bad for my knees. Yeah, that's not true. If you have good that's form what everybody mechanics, says. Uh, usually you're pretty good to keep going. So okay, it's so a technique. Yeah, technique can help. Okay. It's a skilled movement. So. All right, so uh, tell us a little bit more about uh, the event coming up, how you can get involved. And it's a free clinic. It is a yeah. free clinic, and it's in conjunction with the Tosh Jordan River Marathon. Now, you don't have to be running the marathon or half marathon mm -hmm. to do it, um, but it's April 28th at Tosh for, uh, at 6 o'clock in the auditorium. So if you want to come, just stop on by. You can call and reserve a spot. Okay, and, and what about the marathon? The marathon, you can register at the event, the clinic, on the 28th, or there you can go online. It's the Tosh Jordan River Marathon, and you can register there for okay. it. Okay, all right, so. some good stuff, and uh, it's definitely worth it to go to that clinic. Yes. All right, well, Rebecca, thank you very much. Thank Appreciate you. that, and uh, let's head back into the studio now.